Hello and welcome, my name is Sarah and I create mod tutorials for The Sims 4. Today we're gonna go and look at groups, what used to be always ignored in the game, but since the recent patch, it's not ignored anymore. So we gotta make sure that all the groups are now correct, especially if your mod is base game compatible. So in front of me, I have my mod tutorial file. This file is from the lucky and unlucky trade. This episode will be released before the next lucky and unlucky episode. So there are more files in here, um, but we'll go over that into the second episode of the advanced mod tutorials. So I'm just gonna quickly explain what needs to be changed since the recent patch. In this file over here, we see reward tuning and we see group 0000s. Um, you can also find it here in data and then it says group and we have all these zeros. This is correct. Um, so this works for base game or we can change the first zero into an eight and that also works for base game. So now this whole interaction over here is base game compatible. Now what we've got to do is we've got to go and copy the group. And now make sure that any file that says tuning behind it, that everything also has these zeros in here. So we have it over here. Now we have snippet tuning, zero, zero. Action tuning is not a zero, 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 zero. I don't know how many zeros are in there, but we just got to go and change that and same for that one. Then we have a buff tuning over here. Also change that, Does buff tuning here, change that change that and change that. Now the game will read the other numbers that are behind it, that it's from another pack. So interactions and everything, trades, whatever, will not show up if the person who downloads your mod doesn't own that pack. And therefore we got to change everything to zeros or the ones with the eight in front of it. Now we're not done yet. We also got to go into sim data. For the sim data, it's very important you leave the group alone. However, if you're going into here, we now see the U and then the zero times all those zeros. I'm just gonna go and copy that. So we just gotta make sure that that's all zeros as well. And it only really has to change for those that we just changed the group for because that refers to the group of the file that the sim data is connected to. So I think it was these action tunings and the buffs. So here, yes, we see the buff um, and indeed this is um, a three and an F. So we gotta go and make sure that that's now a zero. That one as well, this one and this one. Then we're gonna go and say save. And now this mod is base game compatible. Now, if you wanna be 100% sure that you've done every single file, cause sometimes you can have like tons of different files in there. You can just open this um, Sims 4 TK package viewer, link is in the description down below and then just say choose file. Now, once you open your file, it should say no issues found. So that was it for this very short video. Um, I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below and I'll see you next time. Bye.